Turn off the mains electrical supply before starting work. First, choose a location for the inline relay. It carries mains voltages, so we would recommend that it is installed within an enclosure. For outdoor installations, use a Lightwave RF IP56 enclosure. Run the main supply cable to the live and neutral terminals on the relay, but of course don't connect the mains power yet. Even if switching a low voltage or non-main circuit, the relay must always have mains power to the live and neutral terminals for it to be able to function. Connect the open-close circuits to control the motor. If the motor is mains powered, you need to link the L terminal to the common terminal on the relay output side. The N feed can be fed directly to the controlled motor. If the controlled equipment is low voltage or non-mains, connect the relay output terminals simply to switch on the power directly to the equipment. Turn the mains electrical supply back on. When operated by the smartphone app, the left-hand load terminal will be connected when the open button is pressed. The right-hand load terminal will be connected when the close button is pressed. Both terminals will be disconnected when the stop button is pressed. Using a screwdriver, press and hold down the linking button on the inline relay until the green LED starts to flash. Press the open button once on the smartphone app. The LED on the relay will flash quickly for two seconds and a clicking noise will be heard. Using a screwdriver, press and hold down the linking button on the inline relay until the green LED starts to flash. Press the close button on the smartphone app. The green LED on the relay will continue to flash and a clicking noise will be heard.